Welcome back everyone. I'm here again to present to you what happened this past week at TechZim. ZRP says it needs 4.2 million dollars to secure fingerprint search system. AT&T shuts down its 2G mobile network and sets 3G as minimum requirement on its mobile network. Looking for the best WhatsApp and Facebook deal? Here is a comparison of Econet, Net1 and Telesel bundles. ZRP introduces swipe machines at police stations to handle fine payments. Roadblocks are next. Net1 adjusts its internet lineup, reintroduces generous daily bundles with more data, a dollar for 300 megabytes. No more unlimited access on one fusion as Net1 puts data caps on its flagship package. Zimbabwean startups raised over $1.2 million in 2016. The country is ranked as Africa's seventh most popular funding destination. Net1 increases data on WhatsApp and Facebook bundles. Here is a comparison with competitors' offers. Samsung Galaxy J1 Mini Prime Review. As good as entry-level smartphones get and more. Portras forces Net1 to reverse its data promotions. Net1's promo reversal only for WhatsApp and Facebook bundles data caps. Everything else stays the same. How to protect your privacy on smartphones. All mobile app stores in China are now required to register with the government. Local Facebook group Harare Bidding Wars gains popularity as a leading online auction site for second-hand stuff. And that's all we have for you for this week. Stay tuned for the next update coming in next week.